Hey everybody, hope you guys are doing alright. So I've uh, finally, I just should have done this probably a while ago, but I'm finally looking at the specifics of what goes into, you know, using and working or developing a non-profit organization. So let's take a look. Alright, so the, the 401 on, yeah, okay, so the bottom line is that non-profit founders and employees are paid from the gross revenue of the organization. <clears throat> These salaries are considered part of the operating cost of the organization. <clears throat> the above 411 is from a Google search on how do you pay people in a nonprofit organization. Uh, the below 411 is from a Google search on what's the definition of a nonprofit organization. A nonprofit organization or an NPO is one that is not driven by profit but by dedication to a given cause that is the target of all income beyond what it takes to run the organization. Because of this, NPOs receive tax-exempt status from the federal government, meaning they don't have to pay income tax. <clears throat> Below 411 is from a Google search on the controversies of nonprofit organizations. Uh, so this is a seven scan the the website or the I don't know if it was the article or the web I think it was the article seven scandals from the nonprofit uh, world. Uh, I just use one example. So the Planned Parenthood profit debate of 2015, if I remember correctly, that's what I thought I saw the day was. Uh, members of Center for Medical Progress secretly filmed meetings with Planned Parenthood officials discussing fetal donations, uh, sparking a nationwide controversy. Um, and so here, I'm going to make another video on ways to counter um, that type of stuff happening because, it's, I mean, it's, a, it's just a lot of these organizations are used as loopholes to perpetuate crime and fraud and all sorts of other nefarious activities. So uh, I want to figure out ways to counter that and still use the good essence of a nonprofit organization, which I think is a good thing to do. And there's no reason why. We can use like no web informed against we can prosper like they've been using a lot of the not everybody but some of these mpos have been used for nefarious means well that's still a loophole for people who want to use it for good ways and it can also give investors tax write-offs so i mean it could work out to be a very good thing it doesn't always have to be all bad it's just what your intent is so all right but yeah i'll make another video talking about the counters i love you guys y'all take care all right bye